Hey y'all, it's Miss Twinkies and I'm back to show you another wig. I wanted to let you know not to be afraid of short wigs or wigs that look funny on the website because they're not necessarily a bad wig. Stop and shop and I got the HH Short Stop wig, color 1B. And this is what she looks like. Not very appealing um, when you first see her on the website. But, um, or even when you get her in the package, this is her. It looks a hot mess, but we're going to hook her up. I'm trying to uh, copy uh, Sonya Rowland, her look, and I'm just going to um, show you the inside of the cap. It does not have any combs in it whatsoever. It's a standard human hair um, wig. It just has the straps in the back and that's it. And that's what I'm uh, doing right now is just adjusting them. It's just a regular old wig. Okay. All right. So here we go. Let's get this puppy on and see what it do. Oops. Okay. She looking kind of funny right now, but I'm going to show you. <laughs> she kind of looking like uh, Donald Trump's uh, do. Oh, I forgot how I did it yesterday. Because I tried it on yesterday because I got it yesterday. Now, let me show you what I did to her. Because she wasn't looking right. I'm not liking the bangs or anything right at this moment. But... Okay, now what I did to her is, if you can see, is I just took it and I kind of ratted it every so often. It's only about a, two inches of hair, so to try and rat it to get it to look somewhat decent is, you know, just... I'm going to take a little bit of working with. Now what I'm going to do is, because the sides on, around my ear is a little long, and I haven't ever cut a wig before, so this will be my first time. Hopefully I don't jack it up. So I'm just going to snip around my ear a little bit. I should have did this on the head, but... It kind of looks like, um, if you've seen Waiting to Excel, it kind of looks like Angela Bassett's hair looked when um, when she first got her hair cut. She said, do you want it short, short, short as mine? All the way off. Okay. So, I'm just going to go back with this again. And I'm just going to keep teasing it until I get it how I want. It kind of looked like a 27 piece. Wait, I'm pull it down. A I don't know if this is an epic fail or not, but I think it's a cute wig. It just need to be worked with. This side needs some trimming too. Because it's coming over my ear. So I'm going to go ahead and trim this up real quick. Ooh, I'm cutting my own hair. Oops. I'm going to try and use some jam on it real quick to try and, okay. Now, I, I'm not sure. I mean, it's a cute shorty, uh, Sonya, like I said, Sonya Roland, 
has her hair like this rolling and I was like well shoot this wig right here looked like it would fit you know kind of sort of her uh style or whatever because she got the little boy cut or whatever you know <laughs> y'all gonna have to let me know what you think if she look uh if you like her or not I'm going to turn around for you. Um, I, I think she's a cutie. I mean, she's short, short. And uh, you're afraid to cut your hair this short and you wanted to try it out. This would be a good choice to try. So I'm going to go ahead and turn around. Let me make sure the back is nice and flat. Put a little bit more jam on there. Since it is human hair, I could use jam just to lay it down in the back. I could use jam on here. A lot of people say you don't, you shouldn't put different products on human hair, but if it's human hair, I'm going to work it out. Okay? All right, let's get turned around here. Hi. <laughs> Well, this is her. I hope y'all like this uh, Sonya Rowland inspired hairdo. Um, she is a shorty, like I said, but really cute, lightweight, human hair. So I'm sure that you can take a curl, oops, a curling iron, uh, maybe a smaller barrel, and then get you some, you know, some curls going on. I have to try that out. Uh, but you could, you could technically curl this in bumper. Uh, so that she could lay down or be spiked up however you want, you know. But yeah. So, alright y'all. Thank you again for stopping by. I appreciate it. Give me your honest opinion.